What is your biggest Shalhavit pet peeve? Easily Hashkala Minion. I have to say eat car kids on Tuesday afternoon. Svartic Minion. They're a cult. <laughs> the only thing they're good for is taking all the excess Hashkama people. The grilled cheese. Shalhavit is raving about how their science department has been has been awesome over the past two years. It used to be bad, now it's getting better. Not sure my AP score says the same thing. What does Agenda use their money on? It's and it's for? It's I'm not allowed to share that with the general public. I mean, last year, we actually had some pretty rude thieves in the Shell Heaven administration steal it for sack when everyone knows that Agenda is more important. You think money's only supposed to be used to have fun? Yeah, if. I mean, I know that's like the general idea at Shell Havet, considering we don't, all the money is pretty much used to have fun or do like Israel guidance or whatever. But you know what? We have to start making town hall more important. If school was for investing money into what kids like, it would look a lot different, no? Like if it was about what kids liked, I wouldn't be in, I wouldn't be in classes all day, would I? Maybe I would have like two, because I like about two of my classes. Actually, that's not true. I probably like half of one of my classes. If Shalhava could have one thing that it doesn't have, what would it be? Probably be teachers who stay for more than a year. Can I say something that we should take away mm -hmm. instead of add? How the Ashkenaz population in this school pronounces T as S. What do you think it's Rabbi Block? That rubs off on Honestly, them. yeah. I think they just really look up to him, you know. He's a Maccabee. He's a really, he's a really, really, you know, high up there man. And they just want to respect him and they look up to him. So, mm -hmm. you know, instead of, you know, Kanye fans wear Kanye merch, Rabbi Block fans say son instead of tub. What does Fairness do exactly? Because I really don't think anyone knows. It's a really good question. Um, I'm right there with you. <laughs> <laughs> What's your favorite part about Town Hall? Seeing how long it's gonna take Aviva Laws to skirt Tali every week. <laughs> Who did Mikey Katan vote for? He voted for me because I'm his brother. Well, he definitely voted for me because, like, I'm the best at sack, you know? Me, obviously. Why are there three sack chairs? Yeah. I think that lately Shell Heaven's been just going to a place where people are more into the fun stuff than, than town hall and you just have more people interested and you know people don't like to lose. Because Abby knew she was gonna lose. Isaac and I just felt bad because like we didn't want Abby to feel like she was being excluded because you know she's Ashkenaz. But so we asked for the referendum and then we like fought for it so that like you know, she would feel included and she wouldn't feel like we were discriminating against her because of her background. Um, because we just like work better as three. Is that really why? I would have been sad here otherwise. <laughs> Can you say a fun fact about your co-chair? Her dad's an author. Oh, Jonathan, okay. Um, fun fact. Jonathan didn't come to first period all of 11th grade. Say a fun fact about our agenda chair, Talia Gill. Um, fun fact about Talia Gill. She did not know what the Kiki challenge was until yesterday. Are we doing this? Oh yeah, I'm here for this. Gotta be real with it. Yep. Kiki, do you love me? Are you riding? Say you never ever leave from beside me. Cause I want you and I need you. And I'm down for you always, KB. Like when you heard it, like uh, let's do the Kiki challenge. What did you think? Well, when I heard it being spoken, I was in a car, um, and my friend who wanted to partake in this said Kiki challenge was gonna hop out of the car. So I thought it was something like where you hopped out of the car and like ran around and then hopped back into the car. I feel like I have nothing else to add in this video. Can I just um? 
I, I don't know how to do the Keegan challenge either, but I'm really good at shooting, I'm telling you. Do you love me? Are you riding? Say you never ever leave.